In this video, I'm showing you how to open RAW files in Windows. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like as well. And please do watch right until the end so the full steps for opening up the RAW files. And without any further ado, let's go and get into this. Here we are on my desktop. And as you can see right here, I've got, I've got this RAW file, which I want to go and open and use the files inside of it. So the first thing you want to do is go and open up a web browser. I'm personally using Google Chrome. So go and open it up just like this. Then all you want to do is come to a search engine such as Google. And all you want to do is go and search for something called 7-Zip. Now this is a really great tool as I'm gonna show you how to fully use it, but do keep watching so you know the full steps of doing this. So go and search for 7-Zip just like so, and make sure you come to 7-Zip.org. That is the official website. Then all you want to do is come to this top menu up here. And as you can see, we've got a few different options. So either you want to go and download the 64-bit if you've got a 64-bit system or the 32-bit. So go and check about your system, come down to the search icon just here and go and search for system information just like so. So you get this icon here, go and click on it. And as you can see, my system type is x64, meaning it's 64 bits. We can come and close off of this. And now I'm going to go and click on download on our 64 bit system. As you can see, it's only 1.5 megabytes. Then all you need to do is go and locate the download we just did. So mine is at the bottom of my browser, but yours may be in your downloads folder in File Explorer. So go and look for that if you can't find it. Then all you want to do is go and click on it just like so, and you go and get a Windows security pop-up and here we are. Then you can go and choose where you want to install. I'm gonna leave it there and click install. And as you can see, it's already finished. So then you can go and click close. Then we can come and close off of our browser as well. Then all you want to do is come back to your raw file, click on it once and then right click on it. And all you want to do is go and click on 7-zip. As you can see, we've got a ton of options here. I'm gonna go and click extract here. And what it's gonna do is go and create a folder with the files inside the raw file. So click here and then here we go. It's now gone and created this folder here, example, as you can see, and I'm gonna go and double click on it. And boom, here we are. That is the text file I went and put in it. And it just goes and says hello. And that is exactly how you can go and open up raw files. You can also go and click on it again and click on 7-zip. And there are a few other options as well. For example, just opening the archive and it's gonna go and open up the folder with it in. So there's a few ways of using it, um, but extracting it is my favorite method. If you found this video useful, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. Leave a like for more, peace.